Hey yo together and very welcome to the StarCraft 2 Unranked! The last game didn't really went too well for me, but considering the guy was Grandmaster League, and I'm not, so that's okay. And he was playing Proto, so that's even more okay. Uh, and he wasn't really good, he lost two Observer, um, one to a, sensor, uh, to, to a Missile Turret, the other one to a Scan. So that was... Hmm. I did overcommit a little bit too much. I didn't know if it was blink or uh, adapt, so you need turrets and bunkers to to defend. That that's a problem. But yeah, and the push out. I, I got the wrong army. I got the wrong army. Positioning wasn't the best. Uh, I think the upgrades weren't the best either. So yeah. But it's okay, it's that that's what the unranked is for. Just playing, testing out stuff, try to identify your strengths and weaknesses. And to be fair, I I think I put a good fight on him, but in the end it wasn't enough. I mean uh, wrong army and one bad fight and then you can't recover from it. I tried I, yeah, I went too much on, on Medivax. Against Blink you need some, but not too many. That's that's the secret. Too many is not good. And eight is already a lot of medivacs against against Protoss nowadays. You don't go for so many medivacs normally. Simply don't. The Liberator is just way better. I imagine for Liberator there. Maybe I would have killed the, the Colossus or zoned it. I could have gotten a way better fight. Because the Liberator are way stronger and way better in forcing your opponent to play cautiously. He can't just blink in like he did or shade him, it's so risky. Like tanks, liberators are way better than tanks in positional play, currently. So that that's the reason why you should go for liberate. You can go for tanks, there are some, some tank pushes you can do against Protoss, but now normally uh, it, it is bio liberator with bigger mines. Especially against Adapt Heavy play. And Colossus, yes, they can work against Little Mines, but as soon as you get Liberator range, mm, that's getting really difficult. And then you can switch into Vikings, so that's that's all fine. So if you go up to 8 Liberator 10, then yeah, you can. You, you don't really need to go into, into uh, Vikings, I think it's possible to go with uh, pure Liberator as well. But Vikings tend to still be the better choice, I, I think. So, Zerg is not in the top left hand corner. That's okay. Okay, but he did scout up there as well. So, I think it will be cross position. And I can tell you, cross position Frost is very difficult for, for, for Terran to play. At least for me, I, I think. So I do have problems there. Maybe it's not cross position, who knows? Yes, it is definitely cross position. So be careful if the Reaper don't lose the Reaper. Uh, let's check if he went greedy. No, okay, currently no greed. Okay. At some point, ah, there was a drone. Okay, so he wants to take that base. Ah, that was a bad mistake. Ah, damn it! Because now Stim is so delayed. Stim is at least a little bit delayed. Okay, let's let's not raise the Reaper here. It's not worth it. That is definitely not worth it. Yes, Tim is Tim is no late. I don't I don't hit the timing. So that is indeed really bad. Yes. Don't hit the time. Uh, maybe I will hit that time. I don't know which timing I will hit now. Wait. But we will definitely see how this plays out. 
So he might send... There's another circling. Okay. Guess I can kill that one. Okay. So... This is the timing I might hit now. And I really wanna... Oh, so many circles. Okay. That's very interesting. He's keeping me on my side of the map. Very interesting. And that's good. That's a very good job he's doing currently. A very good job. But eventually I will move out and deal a lot of damage. With this small push. So yeah, he needs to pull back. I, I really do feel I have heavy legs. Don't know if you see it as well or not, but it looks like. Okay. And losing all those marines is bad! Should never happen! Yes, I'm playing very bad here. What am I doing? I don't know. All those misclicks, all those stupid misclicks. Where's the Viking? The Viking needs to kill stuff. Okay, Ravager. I don't know what he's playing now. I really don't know. What's that? That's bad. What the frick? Oh, oh, I see. Oh, God. Come on. No, that, that's not looking good. Not at all. That's not looking good at all. Is he committing to roaches or not? I don't know. Oh, wow. I have no clue what he's playing. I really have no clue what he's playing. What kind of game that is, I don't know. Is he committing to Roach Ravager or not? I don't know. Because if so, my army is quite useless. At least my macro isn't the worst, but it's not the best either, so... Yeah, I think he's committing to Roach Ravager. So I do, I, I can try to multi-drop him and I will try to do this. And I hope that works.
But I have a feeling that that's not really gonna work here. What's going on? Oh, come on. Stupid counter attack, and he forces the cancel. Well played. No, 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 I need, I need to, to kill that one. That's good. So where is his armor? I wanted to multi-drop, which is not gonna happen now, sadly. And I... And I really want that. So let's see if that works. Okay, fungal, fungal. Oh no, that's so bad. So let's. Okay, I can I can kill something here. But if it's working or not, I don't know. Soon he will get uh, Ultralisk and then I have a real problem. It's not looking super bad now, but also not really good. Also really need another base. So maybe get something into that bunker. Try another multi draw. Okay. That could work or it could kill me. I actually don't know. But we will see. So that's where it now counts. But I don't know actually. Maybe I can hold this. But most likely that's looking quite bad. I don't know. But I am everywhere and I'm killing stuff. No, I wanted to rescue the tanks! Oh, goodness. Maybe if I can kill them faster. I mean, I'm still dealing damage over here. I think I, I brought... Yeah, I did it. I think we did it. Big stim? GG. Let's just check if you got some hidden bases. Yeah, but you won't get the planetary. You know. I think I won. Fucking base trades all day. Well. You initiated the base raid, not me. I just went for multi drops and you attacked into me and it took you too long to break me, so GG. But he was really bad and I should have. Look at that. I, I say he was really bad because he was only tier 3 Master League, while I'm currently tier 1. My MMR is at 5,900, uh, 4,900, so. Yeah, but he's near top, near tier 2, I would say, so it's okay. It's okay.
he was not really bad. He played quite smart, to be honest, but I thought Ultralis would be on the way a long time ago, so at some point he did definitely screw that one up really hard. I wanted to see his match history in the game. Yes, APM, army value, there you can see it. Upgrade, that was my plus three, I guess. And workers active well. Okay. Yep. Okay. That's it with that episode. But he has a very good run. Oh wow. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. As always, I wish you a very nice day and goodbye.